creatives welcome back to my channel my name is katie and i'm so excited to share another tutorial with you and today we are going to talk about photoshop and remember last time our lesson was about how to remove the background from your image using photoshop and other tools so if you haven't watched that i'm gonna put the link on the description box down below so you can go over that as well so today we are going to discuss about how to change the background of our image so let's go over the lesson for today i have your photo which i got from free pick and what we are going to do right here is to change this white background to a more colorful background say you don't want to make your image look pretty generic and only with white background um, we can definitely do that in photoshop with few easy quick steps here what we are going to do is to look for an image another one i have here a few images that i got from free pick as well and this one this exact files right here are from design cuts so let's say we want to have this rustic wooden background against our primary subject. So what I'm going to do is just to copy this one and move it over here. And I'll probably decrease the size because it's a little bit big. All right, there you go. I'm fine with this and I'm just going to um, adjust it. And then what we are going to do right now is to make this layer invisible and then go back to our first layer and choose the magic one so that we can um, select our model. Okay, so what we are going to do is to quickly use the magic one so that we can create a selection and choose our model. That's pretty decent. So the next step that you are going to do is to make sure the second layer is visible again and then click that specific layer and then what you need to do is to create a layer mask so you go here and choose the layer mask so that you can add it and then just click it and voila the background was changed now this is a pretty cool trick if you want to say for example you wanted to create a different background for your baby if you want to create a birthday invitation or you just wanted to frame a photo so you can definitely do that let's um, try to see if we can get a photo of a baby um let me see if we have all right we have a photo of a baby right here so let me just open that all right let me check the size because some of the photos that are in free pick are pretty big so we wanted to just make it the right size i'm going to look for a background that would be best fitting for our image so i think we can use this so i'm just gonna quickly copy like we did earlier and then put that here and then adjust so that it completely fills out the canvas and then like what we did earlier remember so remove the visibility and then go back to the first layer now click your magic wand so this is the magic wand and then select all right it did a pretty good job except this area right here so i guess we're good to go now we need to view the second layer again click that layer and add layer mask and voila so that's how quick and easy it is to create a um, a different background for our main subject of the photo let's try to create another one now let me just quickly close out all these tabs and um, we are going to use a summer feel <laughs> kind of photo so let me click on this little girl all right there you go and let me search for a summer kind of photo i think we have a few right here that i got from unsplash so let's choose this photo all right and then like what we did earlier just put the photo right here adjust the size and then make sure that you make it invisible the second layer go to your first layer and make a selection 
and then go back to the second layer and add a layer mask and voila now we have um, a very summery kind of vibe in this photo so please go try and um, apply this technique if you ever create projects you can always tag me at katie paper designs if you have not subscribed yet to my channel please do so and don't forget to top the notification bell as well so that you will be notified when a new video is up i hope you enjoyed this very quick tutorial today and please come back again soon as we continue with the other series that we have in my channel thank you again for tuning in and have a great day everyone goodbye